Hey everybody, Logan here, and today we got another controller video. That's all the reason you clicked on this video, because I picked up these two suckers. Why? Because I do that with all the freaking controllers, too many controllers. So this is the one I wanted. I ended up uh, pre-ordering this one and they still had extras of this one, so I decided to say, what the heck? So we're gonna open these two up. Uh, this is the one that I really want, of course, red and black, derp. And then the black one's really cool. The only thing is now I have four PS5 controllers, I really don't need one, so I might, I don't know. Um, but yeah, these two are really cool. So let's open them up, let's take a look, and well, let's just compare them. We'll compare them with the regular white one as well, and just to, see how the colors look but yeah here we go welcome to rip and data gaming the channel where logan will show you everything from gameplay to gear their crew is here to take you on a journey through every atmosphere releases to news you don't have to choose rip and data gaming is here for you all righty so here we go we got the, uh, what is this? The Crimson? I can't remember what they call this one. Crimson something and... And black something something. We'll call it <laughs> red and black. So, let's pop this sucker open. Yeah, there we go. Not the hardest boxes to open. Um, okay. Mm. Not as fancy as the Xbox boxes, but hey. Here we go. Oh, that is a nice... It's a burgundy. Look at that. That's that's a burgundy. That is a gorgeous color right there. Oops, sorry. Knock the camera a little bit. Oh, that's a that's a gorgeous color right there. Alrighty, so let's move this out of the way. Put you there. Just same with the black one. The only thing is, boxes like this, they don't tend to last. Um, <laughs> I will display them, but I'm not a big fan of the... the, the the packaging. Oh, that really, that's really black. <laughs> Solid black. All the way, everything's black. This is completely, completely black. Oh, really nice. Now let's move this out of the way. We look at those. And now let's compare them to the white one. So, this is going to be your standard white one. Let's take a look. Ideally, they would be identical. Everything seems to be the same. Textures the same. Buttons the same. Uh, buttons actually feel a little better. Those feel the same. D-pad feels... Slightly bit better on this one. They're identical. Everything's the same. They're all completely identical except for color. So, it's not like the Xbox controllers where they add different features, different textures, like with the camo, the, what is it called? The Daystrike camo, I think it is. Uh, Xbox Series X controller it has a bit different texture to it these completely the same uh, 
you're going to be paying if i'm not mistaken i think it's five dollars more for the red one don't know if you really want to do that um i did because i wanted the red but i don't understand why that one would be five dollars more because it's two-tone but then again this one's two-tone all black is the same price as the white uh and black i i do like the all black that, that is a really nice controller uh design and maybe we'll see a console that matches that the black and white is fine red and black is definitely my favorite so tell me what you guys think uh drop it in the comments below did you pick either of these two up uh if so let me know and yeah thank you guys for watching if you haven't already hit that subscribe button hit that like button share this video uh pretty simple just opening in comparison and remember head on over to redbandanagaming.com follow us on our socials check out our teespring uh shop in the link below buy shirts and all kinds of other good stuff and like we always say be legendary Ooh. thanks again